All right, so what we want to do now is we want to get back to our discussion of lambdas, and we want to do something that we've never done in this class before, and that is to take up a large task and break it up into multiple threads that are running on separate cores in the machine. The idea is that if we can take a task and parallelize it, that because we have so many cores working in our machine, we should be able to cut the time significantly. So if we have eight cores in the machine, in theory, we can get the time down to almost one eighth of the original. That's the idea. So what we're going to do here is, first of all, we're going to try and find out how many cores does the machine have. So to do that, this is the method you can call to find out how many processors are available on your machine. So I'm just going to go ahead and print this. OK, let's run it one more time. I'm expecting this machine probably has eight cores. Most of the machines I've come across last couple of years all have eight cores. Well, let's just see. Oh, this one only has six cores. So uh, I'm kind of curious, the, the machines that have been handed out by the, uh, the school on the little laptops, how many cores do they have? Four. And um, those of you running high-end apples in the back, Alejandro, what does your machine say? Who has 20? Yikes. 